Hi, this is Seth Wild with SonicElectronics.com here at CES 2009. And I'm here with Matt from Pioneer, and he's been showing me some of the technology that Pioneer has. And it's been really amazing to, to hear it and to see it. Now, what we're standing in front of is a display that showcases their ASR technology. I guess it's the, the, is it the Advanced Sound Retrieval Technology? Correct. And pretty much the, the Advanced Sound Retrieval, or ASR, um, will greatly enhance the user experience when they're plugging their iPod into any of the Pioneer stereos. So now, well nowadays a lot of people are using the iPod or these digital music sources to listen to music in their cars. Now how is this really going to affect the music that they listen to? Well, the, the, a lot of times when you're compressing music in MP3 or WMA, what ends up happening is you end up losing a lot of frequency response over 20,000 hertz. What ASR does is actually restore that using an algorithm to actually enhance that music and to give the consumer a better sound experience from their iPod. Now we have this set up as a display to, to really showcase that technology and to hear it. And we're going to hopefully be able to pick that up on the microphone. We want to go through and show. But this, this particular unit, um, we have it set up so we can go through and I guess there's two stages of the ASR that you have right, to display? Right. As, as a default, the ASR is off. So those people that actually have don't compress their music as much, they'll actually have very good sound quality. But for those people that really want to get as much music as possible on their iPod, they're going to compress the, the music a lot more, so there's going to be a lot more degradation in the sound quality. So what ASR does is it gives you three steps, actually off, number one, and number two. And number two is actually going to be the best sound quality experience available. So this unit's hooked up to an iPod, and we have, we have some music playing. And so what we're going to do is we're going to have Matt show you how easy it is to go through and to change or to adjust the ASR. Sure. It's a one button push, very simply. Right now, ASR is off as you can see. Press the button. That's auto sound retriever one. And then number two, you can hear it's a lot richer sound quality. And then if you go right from two and shut it off, you can really hear a difference. Now one of the now, one of the key things about that is a lot of our salespeople on the, on the floor are actually demonstrating this to the consumer when they come in. They can come in with their iPod, actually plug right into the unit, and actually hear how great the sound can be coming out of their iPod going through their car speakers. Now, I'm standing here, and this sounds amazing. This sounds really good, especially from when the ASR was off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the microphone right next to the speaker. Hopefully, you'll be able to hear the, the, the huge difference that I'm hearing right here. So if you just want to go through, I guess, I guess turn it off now. Right now Right now it's off? Okay. Hopefully that I was able to pick up and give justice to, to this unit. And to really, well, the, I guess this ASR technology the Pioneer has in really retrieving the, the lost frequencies that comes with the digital compression of music. Thank you very much, Matt. Is there anything else you want to tell us about this ASR technology? Well, we have a live demo on pioneerelectronics.com. So you can go on, you can actually listen to it through your computer speakers. Obviously, it's not the best computer uh, experience you're going to have unless you're listening to them through Pioneer speakers. But it's pretty much in our whole line of single CD and AV products. So you can check it out on pioneerelectronics.com. Well, thank you very much, Matt. Again, this is Seth Wild with sonicelectronics.com here at CES 2009.